hello guys welcome back to our another video of woodmart theme in this complete video we will learn how to customize the mega mino and some html blocks so everything included in this video so please don't skip this video like share and subscribe my youtube channel if you not watch my other videos of woodmart theme you can check link or playlist in the description let's get start this video first let me show you my front page here as always um, as I have already imported by uh, main demo content but uh, in this video today we will keep it separate and we will design our own with the uh, Xmos um, blocks and HTML blocks also the mega menus pages everything we will check these th things so okay let's get start creating mega menus first to create mega menu let me show you here this is our header section as you can see if i hover my mouse to the every page and there is another mega menu here even on the blog section we have another mega menu portfolio about us contact us also for furniture cooking as they all have mega menus or it depends on your business guys what type of business you have you want to create mega menus you simply can create on these mega menus okay to create these mega menus actually these all are mega menus linked to HTML blocks let me show you HTML blocks click all items when you click on all item you will see a lot of mega menus here uh, not only mega menus all HTML blocks here even pop-ups home menu size and packaging a lot of HTML blocks we have how we know how we create some extra because we don't need you you might not sell this product but you want to upload your own product okay first of all the important thing here you have to check your categories in product section go to categories this is your first step here first you have to create your own categories here okay we have accessories clocks cooking furniture lighting toys but in your case you have other products other categories or other niche please I request you create other categories just a simple put the name here category name like uh, mobile phones this we can go with example mobile phones and the slug we will put same mobile phones parent category we will keep it blank in description we will provide description up to 160 character which help us in SEO as well make sure you provide up to 160 character and click add new category when you create new category here downside you will see thumbnail option image for category page title here important is thumbnail here image for category navigation if you want you can provide this one but here in the thumbnail this picture is recommended here let me show you uh, some other category how their picture is put here let me click on edit on accessories and when we scroll down they have provide in the thumbnail the accessory image even we go further more here image for header menu is uh, icon something like icon here okay so you have to provide thumbnail image important here okay now we have category mobile phone already okay now we will decide inside the mobile phone we want to create mega menus right so that's why uh, provide your all categories here then next step will be to create our menu okay I will go to appearance I will go to menus okay here I will create new menu so you don't confuse here click on create new menu I will name it new menu okay 
only new menu i will name it new menu and create menu okay now we have created our new menu here so first step here we simply provide our category just add our category mobile phones how we find this one <coughs> we will find here in the categories uh, product category sorry here view all and mobile phone add to menu okay now we have our new menu with mobile phone category how about the mega menus okay just let me sh save it for this category we have to create a mega menu okay how we create that one we will go to HTML blocks click on all items let me first to save this one okay perfect and now HTML blocks click add new or you can go with yeah add new click add new we will add new block new mega menu I will name it uh, mobile dash mega menu okay now let me re publish it after I publish it immediately I will add it with Elementor click on add it with Elementor okay perfect now we have the space here to create mega menu okay how we create mega menu we have to go to xmos elements scroll down to the extra menu list just drag this one here okay perfect let me go to labels image you can also provide the images let me go back to the menu section or just to find for the menu I mean yeah extra menu uh, mega menu wizard sorry for that mega menu wizard we need this one <coughs> I uh, know this one not okay so to create mega menu first we have to scroll down first we have to create block let me show you what I mean by blocks if I go to furniture here and we have a four rows one two three four first clocks second is laptop kitchen lighting we have a four section let me go to assess cooking cooking we have also four rows first you have to decide how many rows your you want in your mega menu like if you have less items like you have uh, uh, in mega menu you have 5 to 10 I will recommend that uh, that's enough with the single uh, mega menu list okay but I still teach you how to create two rows three rows four rows. okay I will click here on plus icon 
I will click Flexbox. Let's go with select four rows. Okay. Okay. Now we have four columns here. Let's click here the elements or you can click plus uh, plus button here within the container and you have to find for extra menu list just bring it to the first section okay again click on the plus icon again bring it to the next box like that if how many you want if you want only three just to bring your mouse to this gray container okay delete it click on delete great go to this gray button here you can see my mouse here edit container right click delete and we have only left three column but if you want to just keep delete others or you can choose from the flexbox two columns okay let me click upper here upper section containers okay just to make it middle you want to make it center justify its center or start okay you can play with like that or you can select this one space around if you want to give space okay let me go with here this one okay now let's start creating the mega let me delete this one okay as we are creating mega menu for the mobile phones that can be uh, mega menu can be um, uh, uh, keypad phones smartphones tablets like that right let me click on this pencil icon or within the box right click edit extra menu list click on that scroll down to first one menu child item one expand this one click on it and name it keypad phones okay just keep change all number two smartphone here in the title change it okay <coughs> if you want to add this label like new uh, in the green color this is we call it label like hot product or you, know, you guys have to go to labels if you want to choose red color blue color for the label you can choose this one okay you can name it hot new latest like that latest and this will be show in blue color latest okay latest to smartphones let's go to child menu child item 3 tablets okay we will go with only three let me delete all this okay now this is our mega menu how we link this mega menu okay let me first update this one we now the next step we will go back to the categories again products categories here we will create parent category now okay for our keypad phones for our smartphones for our tablet now first we will go to keypad phones the parent category will be here select mobile phones okay add to add new category okay parent category will be something look like this they have it it has a dash long dash okay now we have keypad phones we need this link to link here okay when we create these sections list you will see uh, let me go to keypad phone when we, when I expand this section keypad phone in the title in the link we have to provide that keypad phone link here okay I will go to our categories right click on view copy link address that's all your work you have to get your 
keypad phone link here and provide that particular link in the link section that's all click update do this for all your for all your mega minus okay same smartphones first you have to create parent category for the smartphone provide smartphones slug smartphone as well smartphones in the slug smartphones parent category mobile phone add new category and now we need link of smartphone right click on view link copy link address go back provide the link in the smartphone here yeah. click on link okay but you want to add image also there okay this is the first section for the link next for the label third for the image let me provide image here you can pack, pick uh, you have to provide smartphone image here for example let me go with any image here for example okay you can provide every mega menu images there okay s s click update now we also need to change the title menu parent item let me check this one yeah we need to name it smartphone mobile phones we will link it to s mobile phones mobile phones okay perfect now our mega menu showing mobile phones keypad phone latest smartphone tablet this is our mega menu now okay now how to link this mega menu to our main menu okay for the mobile phone also please provide the link in the go to mobile phone right click on view copy link address provide the mobile phone link here in the upper section save update okay so this is the process to creating mega main different section first you have to decide how many column you need then you have to go with single one by one in the list items that's all your work if you want to add more item just click on add item keep add item this will be added to your mega menu okay let's now attach our mega menu to the main menu go to menu section appearance menu section now we have already mega menu this one and we have also category mobile phone we already create the menu here in the menu section okay let me wait let me click on here appearance menu okay perfect now we already select new menu we just create earlier new menu we already have that we already also have mobile phone okay so what how we link this one we just click on expand this category scroll down you will find option here let me scroll down
let me go to categories let me go to mobile phones click on add it okay yeah here it is when we go to mobile phone when we edit the category on main mobile phone keep scroll down to extra description select HTML block okay select our HTML block menu we just menu mega uh, mobile mega menu okay we just create in HTML block this ones right we select in the categories okay click update that's all your work okay we already create mega menu for mobile now how we display this one let if I show you my website now we have uh, the default one the menu section let me show you okay that's that's really easy guys first of when you create our your mega menu here just you have to go back to your categories edit your main category edit main category not parent categories because parent category we just create to link here just to provide the link here okay we have to edit main category like mobile phone is the main category but parent category is inside it okay that's why we only added main category mobile phone okay this one when you scroll down you will see option HTML block extra description under HTML block okay they also provide option added this block with page builder okay if you want to edit this furthermore you can edit. just click update that's only your work to link this one okay now I will show you how to display how to add our category to the main menu to the front page first you have to create all your mega menus first guys first do one thing first go to categories first create all your categories I will also suggest you to create all parent categories as well before just keep on the paper what category you are going to or you can design it what category what uh, what uh, mega menu will be like you have a category example um, for the sports for the mobile phones and for them under the mobile phone you which options in mega menu you have parent categories create those one as well under the accessories or sports create those one when you create this mega menu here in the mega menus in HTML blocks then it will be easy for you to do work okay because you have already ready all the categories and parent categories okay now let me go to woodmart theme option and header builder now we will link our we will show our header to the main website let me show you main website here now right now we have a browse categories is the default one all default one okay now what we will do we will default page uh, default header layout we will click on edit scroll down to the header bottom because we are going to edit this one browse category section okay go to header bottom you will see small edit icon click on it and select your menu we will select our just create menu new menu okay save save header 
now if I open my website again now we have our own categories now let me refresh okay let me fix this one edit current header go to woodmart section in the admin panel go to header builder edit current header we need to edit current header because sometime when you change your menu it may take some time to display okay yeah here it is actually we have to go to header base we go to earlier in the he default header not a default header we have to go to header base when you go to woodmart theme header builder you will find header base i think number two option we have to go there in order to edit everything in our main header yeah this one header base or you can see this one highlighted header base click edit this one we need to edit now we will go down to the categories you will see categories Mag uh, main menu is this one the main row this one this is main menu this is categories I hope you understand now let me go to main menu edit now I select here new menu here save changes save header ah, sorry for that we have to go into this one header base go to categories select this one choose menu new menu here we need to choose new menu click save and save header if I now open my website for sure it should work <laughs> I'm very sure this will work now I hope you're not laughing I know right now I will make it work don't worry I will show you it will work very soon maybe we are missing something here categories oh sorry for that let me name it menu title browse browse categories drop down yeah drop down click save now save header or let me name it new categories so we will see changes if we are getting getting our changes okay now let me open front page hopefully this work now if not work I will show you why it not work <laughs> let me try to open into new tab I think if I open this here into private tab it should work because sometimes it calls cookies in our browser yeah we are right it's working mobile phone if we hover to mobile phone yeah it's true we have some time in the browser cookies that's why it not work sometime but you have to clear your browser cookies before you check the changes let me refresh as you can see our mega menu not working how to fix this one 
go back to appearance go to menu and now scroll down we already select a new menu as this is our new menu expand this uh, section mobile phone we have to disable page anchor and the hover design default you have to check settings okay save changes okay let me check now let me go to my new private tab again yeah it's working here okay now okay let me check why it's not working let me go to HTML blocks let me go to first categories new menu yeah new menu and then our yeah open menu item drop down okay click save changes now save header let me try this one now let me select here our new menu click select now as you can see we already select here mobile phone category we just expand this one okay when we drop down here you will see drop down setting let me click on default uh, full width yeah after we uh, select full width here under the design we will go scroll down to HTML block for drop down we will select our mobile mega menu here okay I hope you understand now let me repeat this one under drop down setting select full width or if you want full height okay full width scroll down you will see new option HTML block for drop down just select our new created mega menu mobile mega menu we just created here here this one this we name it mobile menu okay we just created it this is actually HTML block we have to select this one only we don't need to drop a single one by one for the drop down we just only have to select HTML block here click save menu okay now if I open my website into new tab our drop down uh, mega menu will be working let me wait for this okay as you can see our mega menu is now working if I hover my mouse to the mobile phone we have new drop down here mega menu you can create two or three that's depend on you guys depends on your uh, on your business but upper here if you want to display image upper the mobile phone that's why I suggest you go to your categories provide thumbnail image there let me provide thumbnail image so I will explain uh, very well let me go to products categories sorry for that go to categories enter categories we will scroll down to mobile phones click add it because this is our main category mobile phone is a main so here we need to provide our thumbnail scroll down to the thumbnail upload add image 
let me pick any image here mobile phone I don't think so we have mobile phone let me pick any image use image update okay let me try to refresh here you have to provide here image for category navigation let me pick any image click update okay let me refresh now and you will see our image will be there not yet yeah let me scroll down for yeah header menu sorry for that we have to provide in header menu let me pick actually this is uh, we only need to pick provide SVG like icons let me pick this icon click update now let's check this out if our image is available or showing in mega menu yeah but we have icon here this is for here but it should be working if you provide your thumbnail image maybe this is because the thumbnail image is more width we have let me yes we have to go here image for category page title let me try this one we can try you can try uploading different way images here because sometimes images are width or more height not fit to the section that's why not showing here because it we need only icon here maybe okay let me try to upload here because it should working here in the navigation section let me delete all those category navigation image for category navigation this is what we need yeah maybe we need to wait okay as you can see our mega menu is working like a mobile phone keypad phone smartphone if I click smartphone it will be open smartphone section like this you also can can add it these things after you click add a category here you also can add it these things okay let me click on edit with Elementor promo pop-up I think this should be under promo pop-up or you can find the setting in the woodmart theme setting and you can go to page titles or product archive let me check product archive if we want to display those relative categories or sections we just to see earlier here let me click on mobile phone let me delete but if you want to provide image in your mega menu here let me go back to the 
HTML blocks even you can design your HTML block as you want you want to add some image some fancy words you can do it let me first check this one for the category archive let me check this one which is where it belong to yeah page title under the product archive okay let me go back to the categories let me refresh let me go back to mobile phone again smartphones it will open category this one I'm talking about accessories clocks but if you want to keep you can keep it uh, but I still can teach you how to remove this one okay categories HTML block and categories all items I think it should be under category banner let me add it with Elementor actually in Woodmart we have HTML blocks some some of them are directly uh, customizable with edit with Elementor but most of time we see HTML blocks in in most of the sections no this is not so how you can check this one directly you can click on add it with Elementor let me go back to front page and go to menu smartphone or tablet keypad phone anywhere add it with Elementor click on that promo pop-up pre photo photo column one dark mobile mega menu okay let me go here with the footer let me check yeah footer here footer section mobile pre footer yeah here let me go to pre photo it should be here in the pre photo section because if we go down to the sections those will be under page I will also explain you about these HTML blocks
let me try the options in theme setting product archive if we find category styles Let me try add edit category. Okay, you can check some other HTML blocks here in HTML block section, which you can find here simply. Like category banner, you have to for uh, you have to find uh, something about category. Okay, or we can skip this for next video. Okay, so we can focus on our uh, direct video on other some other topics to create our front page because oh, our video is little longer already. So we can start creating our front page from the scratch. Okay, for the header, if you want to make changes in the header, let me repeat. But you can watch my header video in description, Woodmart header. But still, I will go here in the bookmark, go to header builder and uh, we will go to again header base section, header base, click on header base here. Anything you want to change, you can do changes. Let me explain you later quickly here. Okay. We have special offer theme. Actually, this is a menu. Which menu is it? You can know here header link. Okay, this is related to header link menu. You can know the menu every time you go to header builder. Just go to the section, bottom section. This is bottom section. This one. This is bottom section. Okay. This is a menu name header link so what we will do we will go to appearance menus and upper section we will choose header link here header link yeah this one header link click select and you will see both pages are here these pages purchase theme special offer as here it is you want to change or you want to add something nice here just a delete old one okay let me delete this one as well okay you want to add something like coupons contact us just go to pages select what which type of page you want to add here for example about contact us or you can also provide the cart page but we already have cart here like uh, contact us or about us okay let me add both in header link now if i save changes this will be changed to the main header here 
okay you will see now we have a new menu here this section actually these are three menu section one uh, this one one this one the center one is second the category one three menu three menu under is under header this is between header the middle header upper header this is how it works okay you understand the structure here when you go to bootmart theme builder when you click on header piece you will understand the structure of your header directly from here okay but if you want to delete anything just you don't want to show these pages these pages downside you just to simply delete this one when you scroll your mouse here menu you will see small delete remove section nearby the edit okay for example if you want to remove the card section from the middle row or my account or anything just go to middle row you will see main header top bar header bottom three sections i hope you understand okay if you want change anything in the color or anything animated you can do within inside that at for example this is a search section the between section just click edit you can choose what you want or style you can choose this style for the search this one let me go to this one here even you can choose fonts if I refresh now you will see my header section search will be changed like that let me refresh let me save header like that okay but if you want to change colors go to style scroll down to form text color or placeholder color you can choose let me choose form text color to red just to show you how you can make changes okay let me refresh let me open into new tab because sometimes cookies issues they should be work okay as you can see we have now red color and the box also changed 